So first thing we're going to do is change the password to something more manageable. Get my book here. <clears throat> By the way, I am not a Linux guru. Uh, I do. I'm just enough to be dangerous, but uh, I poke around enough until I get things done and figure it out. And I'm just trying to share with you from a simpleton's point of view of how this thing works and how to get it going. So the first thing we're going to do is set our root password. So there's password and the user root. Set our password. Okay, so now we've got our password updated. Now we're going to change directory. We're going to get into the opt directory. I like to put my stuff in there, so. Okay. First thing we're going to do is get the git package. So, because the guys at DB Switch, uh, they use git, G-I-T, for everything. So, apt git install git. That's going to install the git package. All right, we've got the git package installed. <clears throat> now we're going to get the uh, simple installer for Python. And I found a website that a guy has and uh, package seems to work well, so I'm, we're going to go to that. To begin. Okay, we've got that. <clears throat> now we're going to install it. Okay, now we've got that guy installed. Now we need to install Twisted for Python. If you don't get this installed, uh, when you go to install the other Python packages, uh, it will complain about not having the twisted package. So, and we're doing this all with Python three because the the new DV switch stuff is uh, the HB Link is HB Link three for Python three. And everything from this point will be developed for Python 3. So we will specify Python 3. Okay, we've got that guy installed. Now we're going to go get the packages from the DB switch guys. First thing we'll get is the DMR Utils. DMR Utils 3. Uh. Um, I had to redo that. If you make a typo, it asks you for a login prompt which is not what you want. So if you get that login prompt, uh, when it's asked you for a username or password for uh, the Git repository, you've probably typed something wrong. So I'm going to hit the up arrow because everything's the same, but the end, what I did is I did uh, N-O-M-J-S instead of N-0-J-M-J-S. Uh, so now we're going to get H-B-Link 
dot git. That's all we have to modify. Okay, so we've got that cloned in. Basically copied it over from the git repository. Now we're going to change directory to the dmr utils 3. Now we're going to do a uh, modification so it's executable. Okay, and now we're going to execute it. If you run into an error, the first thing you should try is do an app get update and app get upgrade. Because there may be something missing. Okay, let's try to execute it again. That's one thing to keep in mind uh, when you're installing something from somebody's instructions or whatever. Uh, don't forget to do an app get update and app get, apt get upgrade. Um, sometimes there are some missing things that you need in there uh, for the package that they're showing you how to install and uh, it may not already be there. So. As you can see, it went right through that time. Okay, let's go to the next step.